I'm Nachola the Drawer, an artist and adventurer from the UK. Let's get creative. Hello. So today, we can go on an adventure. A can adventure. So this break can. But I think we can make some art out of it. So that's what we're gonna do today. We're gonna make some art out of leftover spray paint cans. Create something colorful, positive, inspiring, empowering for women. Women can do it. I've done in the past some spray paint cans. I spray painted. She can dance in the rain. These cans are available in my shop. So if you would like to buy one, I will leave the link below. And so this time we're gonna do She Can Climb Mountains. Let's start with cleaning the can putting a hole in the bottom, making sure that there's no um, aerosol ball thingies in it, painting the can and then drawing our women on it. I headed to dad's workshop so that he could help me with some of the tools. <laughs> so what are we doing here? Right, what we're going to do is we are going to drill a hole into the base of this can so that we can extract the ball bear in the tin there. This is the fun game you get to play, trying to get the ball bearing out the hole. <laughs> oh, no. There they are, there's the culprits. That one there, and that one's down there. One can down, three more to go. Number two. Holes drilled, cans cleaned, and then we can get on to the next step. Now it's time to spray them. Making the most of the sunny weather here in England to get outside and spray in a nice ventilated area. Let's add the colours. Four new cans, four different colour combinations, and we're gonna do She Can Climb Mountains. So I've got my first can, now I'm gonna use a chalk pencil to draw on to the can my figure that I'm gonna paint. So these are my initial sketches. So why am I doing She Can Climb Mountains? I want to put that image out there of women on the top of mountains because I think climbing mountains and hiking can help you both mentally and physically tackle anything. Like if you can physically get to the top of a mountain with just the force of your own body and then feel that euphoria at the top of reaching your goal you can apply that to anything. It doesn't matter how long it takes you to get there, how you do it, what you look like, what you're wearing. What matters is that you have achieved your goal, and that you get that feeling of getting to the top of the mountain and seeing you, small you, and then you are tiny in the bigger world at the top of a mountain and looking below and seeing where you've come from. I think it's such a powerful feeling that I want to put that out there. I don't know if you like hiking, if you've climbed a mountain, if you've never climbed a mountain before, you should give it a go. I've been lucky enough to do it in lots of different places around the world. I've taken any opportunity. So I was traveling alone in Bali and there's a volcano there that you can climb and you climb it to get to the top for sunrise. Oh, the feeling of getting up there in the dark is quite difficult with the um, underfoot because it's like sandy. 
and then getting to the top for sunrise, there is no feeling like it. Or if you're climbing a mountain on a rainy day. Beautiful day in sunny Scotland. Give us a wave. <laughs> you have it somewhere that you're trying to get to, the top of a mountain. You know you can do it. You know you might get challenges along the way. Your body might ache. You get absolutely drenched by the rain. It takes longer. You slightly go off path and you have to go a slightly longer way around to get there. These are all challenges that I think set you up great for anything else in life. So that's the reason why I'm putting women on the top of mountains on cans as pieces of art because she can climb mountains and so can you go out and do it i would love these cans to be like little reminders you have it there on your shelf in your bedroom in your living room wherever it is a little reminder that if you're having a day that you're like i cannot handle this you just remember that you can climb mountains so if you need this reminder or you know a friend that does that when they see it they'll think joy and it'll empower them then you should get them one they'll be available on my website i've also got my previous collection that i did that was she can dance in the rain that feeling of you know even on a rainy dull gray day you can embrace the day and feel your power and dance in the rain. Now I'm gonna paint these women on the cans and so I'm gonna use acrylic paints, I'm gonna use my Windsor and Newton paints and I'm gonna make them fun and have nice patterns and colorful and I've got these previous projects that I did for on a fence which were called Wonder Women and so I have kind of ideas of colour combinations. I'm using my golden acrylics as well. The box is also useful for holding steady so then I can paint on this bit here. got the painting and the splat. Now that they're finished they just need to have a coating on them to protect them and then they're all ready to go. So they will be up on the website, there'll be She Can Climb Mountains and there'll be She Can Dance in the Rain and they'll be up on my website. They are £40 per can and that includes free shipping so if you need a little She Can of positivity Go buy one if you've got a friend that needs some inspiration and motivation. Get her a she can and she can use it as a little inspiration. Thank you so much for watching. I'd love to know what you think. Do you like the She Can Climb Mountains? Did you prefer the She Can Dance in the Rain? Or is there a can that you'd like me to do in the future? I am available to do commissions if there's a She Can you have in mind. Let me know below in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell. <laughs> Get out there, go for adventure, climb a mountain, or climb your own personal mountain. You can do it, I believe in you. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you for the next creative adventure.